Hey guys, in this video, we are going to take a look at how to turn your Redmi Note 7 Pro into Pixel 3 XL. So without wasting more time, let's start. Okay guys, so what I meant turning your Redmi Note 7 Pro into Pixel 3 XL is in terms of software, not hardware. So as you can see, Pixel Experience ROM has been launched for our Redmi Note 7 Pro and it's official, like it's unofficial, but yeah, it's okay guys. You can see Android version 9. Android security patch level April 5 and we have this kernel build from source and you can see this is the 15th April build okay guys so starting from the launcher you can see we get this pixel launcher from Google like all of the Google pixel 3 stuff will be in build and you can see we have uh, this all of the Google pixel 3 launcher stuff you can see icon to home screen at a glance suggestions display Google app changing icon shape and it works really well like there are no such issues so this is the pure pixel launcher also guys we have google now support you can see it works really well then into the app drawer you can see all of the google apps have been installed and there are no such usb apps so all of the new refreshed material designed apps material design 2 apps are present let's move into the settings so you can see into the settings you can see we get this pixel theme so this is a pixel ui it's present so that's also great not a teal one into battery you can see the battery indicator and all of your performance and all stuff the battery performance then you can see into display you can get night light which works really well so you can see it turns yellowish and great for the display and also the your eyes and sleep sleep timer display size ambient display everything is present but just not always on display so and yes it's not it's like not possible to get always on display it's like it is like not at all needed for your device so yeah okay guys one thing you should note that tap to wake you can see this feature here double tap to wake but it doesn't work because it is not enabled so double tap to wake doesn't work so please make this in mind also guys you can see digital well-being is present rebuild so yeah it's a pixel experience so of course all of the stuff is present of course guys pixel experience rom is a pure pixel project so you can see into the system we get gesture swipe up on home button it works well you can see we get the google pixel also uh, the animation pixel animation and also the assistant on long press we have some extra stuff here Oops, sorry into the developer options we have advanced restart so you can press restart and you can either boot into restart like just restart the device boot into recovery or boot into bootloader mode also guys we do have a smallest width uh, option under developer option so you can change the width and you can change the dpi so that it looks really tall and great now guys you get the snapdragon camera pre-built as you can see and it has a really limited functionality so not all of the stuff for a redmi note 7 pro is present but you can install the google pixel camera from the pixel 3 which is a fully working camera guys as you can see you can switch to videos videos work camera works fine portrait mode and we have panorama lens pillar all of the options from the google camera which work really fine also you can just uh, add this uh, script you can see which i'll be making a separate video on the google pixel camera for this so if you have already made it you can check the i button for that but not then you can check it later and you just have to restore this so like the config will be in the description you have to install the google camera into the files you have to make this uh, okay into the internal storage you have to make this gcam configs folder add that file the config file and after opening gcam double tap the black area and restore that file and all of the settings will be really well and you can easily click like awesome pictures with the gcam so yeah that is how to completely turn your redmi Note 7 pro into a pixel 3 xl with the camera and everything working so yeah guys that's it for the video if you guys really like this video press the like button already and we are now going to check with the installation so for the installation you have to power off your device and make sure you have TWRP recovery installed now guys you need to uh, press the volume up and power button to boot the TWRP recovery so in case anyone if is like a beginner for flashing ROMs because as you can see I have this TWRP recovery installed then you have to wipe your Dalvik cage system vendor and data if you are coming from any other ROM like LOS or CR droid which are also released for the uh, Redmi Note 7 Pro and I will be making a video soon 
then you have to install these lineage firmware violet which is a uh, redmi note 7 pro firmware that 10.2.80 so you have to install this after it gets successfully installed you have to go again to install and check pixel experience and reboot after the installation is complete now as pixel experience it already has G apps because Google like the pixel 3 comes with G apps so it already has G apps pre-built so don't no need to install separate G apps and then you are ready to go with like just going to signing your Google account and then boom you can set up your device and easily turn your Redmi Note 10 Pro into a pixel 3 XL so it's just installing the pixel experience ROM so guys as you can see the ROM has been installed and I had the auto reboot selection so it has auto rebooted I can see Redmi by Xiaomi your boot logo and just wait for the Google Pixel 3 boot animation so this is the Pixel 3 boot animation looking really great on your Redmi Note 7 Pro and yep this is how to install the Pixel Experience ROM or turn your Pixel 3 XL uh, sorry turn your Redmi Note 7 Pro into a Pixel 3 XL so yes guys that's it uh, if you guys really like this video Press the like button, if not press the dislike button, subscribe for more videos, see our dot reviews coming soon and see you guys in the next one. Till then, bye bye. Also a lot of Redmi Note Pro videos are coming so please guys subscribe to the channel. Also the full review is coming, yes soon, it is a one month review so please guys stay tuned for that before even like if you are even like getting a chance to buy it or if you are even waiting to buy it because the flashes are like literally shit. So, yep, stay tuned. Bye-bye.